I took my friend Elizabeth Glazer, who was dying um, of AIDS, to the White House because Elizabeth wanted to save her son before she had, unbeknownst to her, contracted AIDS in a blood transfusion and passed it on to both her children. Her daughter died. Her son was still alive. And there was no, there were no drugs at that time for children. You, they hadn't tested them for children. They existed, but they c wouldn't give them to kids because they hadn't tested them for dosage and efficacy. So she said, can you take me to meet the First Lady? And I said, yeah. And we went there, and, and Hillary that day started changing things, uh, making the pharmaceutical companies test. And he's still alive today, and he counts Hillary as the reason he's alive. And I count him that way, too. I don't know if Hillary's ever said that in a speech. Maybe she has. I doubt it. I've never heard it. There are hundreds of stories I could tell you like that. And she's, she's, you know, she's not the best person at selling herself in the world, to be honest with you. But who she is, she, it's not the poetry of speaking. It's the poetry of doing. That's what I say about her. She's a worker. And um, I'm extremely proud to be her friend.